Hi everyone, this is Funky Gonuts, and I just wanted to tell you that there is a new jailbreak for the Apple TV 4, fourth generation, on iOS 10.2.2. The iOS is still being signed, so get it quickly, get it now, get it today, before Apple stops signing. So I already have it on here, but I'm going to just do a whole new restore on it, show you how this how, uh, how you do it. Right, I'm going to hit Options, Restore. There's my Apple TV right there. Whoops, I'm having major computer problems here. Uh, where, where's my desktop? Ah. So, iTunes will erase and restore Apple TV to version 10.2.2. So yes, it's pretty quick. I have my lovely son assisting me on holding the uh, camera. Okay, so the wire you need is, what the heck is that wire called? I think it's a C wire. I'm, um, I'll show you. I have it in the show you. If you look over here, look right in there. Oh, this is Dolan. Can you see it? Right there. Okay, this is the same wire that uses a switch, the Nintendo, uh, the Nintendo Switch. Uh, I think it's a C, it's called a micro C wire. All right, it's almost done. So like I said before, you have to down, you can still downgrade if you're all, if you're on the newest firmware right now on the Apple TV fourth generation, you can downgrade it. What you do is you uh, download the software, the firmware, then you uh, connect it with the micro C, the, with the little cable, connect it to your computer, your Mac, um, and you hit com uh, option, uh, restore, and click on the iOS operating system, uh, and then it will downgrade, but you should do it soon. Okay, so the uh, Restoring is almost done. I gotta get my hand. Why? Because you need to put all the information because you're restoring everything. Alright, so it's verifying Apple TV software and <laughs> done so I can unplug it soon. Hold on. It will tell you that you can unplug it when it's done. What the freak? That did when I did it, it took a long, it took quick, it was fast. Okay, your Apple TV has been restored to the factory setting. So I'm going to take it out. Are you just showing the plug again to see if it's... Uh, never hit okay. Nope, just uh, look at here. Plug it. Connect it to the HDMI. Bring it to the TV. Okay. Alright, so... English. You know what? I wonder if I could do for America. I'm gonna say we're from the U.S. because my Siri won't work in Germany for some reason. So let's see, United States. Where the heck is United States? Just saw it. Wait, go down. There's United. Can you go yeah. United States? Let's click on that and see what happens. <clears throat> Set up with device. Okay, so you gotta get your. Oh. I wanna use my phone? No, it's okay. You know what? I'll do this later because I forgot my son is on my phone now, so I'll do it later. Don't use Siri. You can always set it up later. Set up the device, set up manually. later. You know what? 
Just tell me when there's a code. The code's gonna come on to the TV, okay? You know what? We're gonna pause it, and then I'll get back to it. So I'll be right back after I do all the setup. Stop. Okay, so went through all the setup, setup. So here it is. Here's the main screen. Okay, go to settings. The first thing you do right away is you go to systems, software updates, automatically update off. That's the first thing you do right away. All right, let's go to let's go to generals. Okay, let's go to about and let's see. See right there, I am on, what the heck? 10.2.2, okay? Now, these are all the icons I got on here. I'm gonna take it out, plug it in with the C cord. Don't exactly know what this it's not a micro USB cord, so don't look for a micro SD cord around your house to uh, connect to the um, computer. Okay, now that I have everything on, I'm having problems with my computer or something stuck. All right, you're going to go to City Impactor. Okay, and then you go to the Green Goblin. So let's go to the Green Goblin. Whoopsie. <laughs> Bring the Green Goblin down. <laughs> no way. Shoot, what the heck is my password to this thing? Loading. Is it reflecting? Yeah, You are going to get an error code after it's up to, uh, installed. Don't worry about it. It's already, it's being installed onto your uh, Apple TV. So let's see. Connect. See the error code right there? Yeah. Look, look. Do not worry about this. Just hit OK. Okay? Okay. Then you unplug it. Connect it back to the TV. And you will see the Green Goblin um, logo onto the Apple TV. Okay, cool. Look at that. There's the Green Goblin. All right, so let me just double check to make sure that the automatic update is off. What the heck? Okay, well, let's go to the Green Goblin. Now, with the Green Goblin, you have to do this about 15 people upstairs. No, okay, so you're gonna hit jailbreak. So you say exploit kernel. Oh, you know what? For me, because I probably did it before. Yeah. And it went through. So it's going to, the first time, it's going to do it about 15 times. Don't worry. Just keep on doing it and keep on doing it until you see this. Okay. I'm going to hit the respring. When it resprings, you should see the Nido TV icon. Nido? 
Nitro TV, see right there, Nitro TV on the bottom. Let's go check down below. There it is. Then your T, uh, Apple TV is jailbroken on the 10.2.2 uh, firmware. Like I said before, you guys, do this as soon as you can. Let's do it today. Downgrade. Install the newest or update. If you're on the oldest firmware, update to the 10.2.2. If you're on the newest firmware, downgrade to the 10.2.2. All right, if you like this video, please subscribe and hit that thumbs up button and I'll see you soon. Bye. Bye.